and the right hand carries on with this, what's known as an ostinato. You don't have to remember that. It's kind of helpful to have a label for these things. It's a pattern of notes that just keeps repeating. So if you wanted to get that um, rhythm in your body, um, maybe you could consider practicing your scales or practicing one or two scales in that. Useful. If you're a piano teacher and you're about to teach this piece to somebody, say, let's have D minor with the Virginia Hall rhythm. Do it hands together. Kind of neat. If you can practice that way as well, it will make your scale practicing just that little bit more interesting and alive. <laughs> 